All right then guys, now that we are on the topic of routes, let's talk about another interesting topic called named routes. And honestly, named routes is something I use a lot when I work with Laravel. It lets you refer to a route when generating redirects or URLs more comfortably. And this may sound weird, so let's test it out. Well, first off, let's get rid of our last two routes because we only need the basic first one, which is referring to the index. What we want to do in simple terms is basically to assign a nickname to this specific route with the name method. Let me actually align it first. All right. Right after our route, let's point to a method called name. And inside the method, we could write down any name that we want. And this could be identical to the endpoint products, but it could also be something else. But what I actually recommend is to keep it identical to the endpoint. So let's say in single quotes, products. Now let's save it. Let's go to our index function in our products controller. All right. And actually let's clean it up because we don't need our variables and array. Let's get rid of the data that we have inside our return view. All right, let's save it. Let's clean up our view as well products, index, and let's get rid of our paragraph. All right, so in our products controller, excuse me, before we write down any code, it's good to know that the route method is a global method, which basically means that we could use it anywhere in our code. Now, whenever we want to specify the index page of our products directory, we basically could say, well, we want to print underscore R, a route, which is a method, that refers to the name of products. Let's save it. Well, let's change the endpoint to forward slash products. And you can see that our entire URL has been printed out. This is also pretty handy when you work with buttons. So let's hop to our views. So our index.blade, right below our H1, let's create an answer. Let's name it, well, let's say products. And the href needs to be curly braces. We want to say the route is single quotes products. Save it, hop to Google Chrome, refresh the page. Let's click on products and the endpoint is still the same. This is very useful when you want to link stuff easier to each other and you can easily change the URL without changing all of its references.